If you could talk to your dog, you might be surprised to find out what kinds of human habits dogs find annoying. They obviously can't tell you these things. If your dog isn't behaving in the way you'd like, they may simply be reacting to your own behavior. In this video, I talk about the 21 human behaviors dogs hate the most. Now let's get started. Number 21. Dressing your dog in clothes. Just as much as they detest being hugged, dogs detest this human behavior. They wish people knew how dangerous and intimidating clothing is. Your animal friend feels threatened when you dress them in a bunny costume. They would undoubtedly curse at you if they could communicate verbally. Number 20. Dinner time interruptions. You would become irritated if someone kept touching you while you were eating. Place the dish in a place with little traffic when your dog is eating. And tell your family members to respect the dog's right to privacy. Let him indulge in the meal. Number 19. Same food over and over. Dogs don't like it when you eat the nicest cuisine and all they get is dog food. So make a special meal occasionally and let your pet eat their favorite dish. Fortunately, you do not need to radically alter your dog's diet every single day. Dogs don't grow tired eating the same food as frequently as humans do since they have a smaller number of taste buds. Number 18. Being put away when friends come over. Dogs are incredibly sociable creatures. Allowing your dog to go outside when your friends are over will prevent them from feeling like they are being kept in solitary confinement. Your dog will get an opportunity to form bonds with your pals and also pick up better manners with strangers. Number 17. Not playing with them enough. Dogs love to play and have fun with their humans. This is one of the best ways they can spend time with you. But some people are too busy to play with their dogs as much as they would like. The result? A bored dog who will find a way to entertain themselves. Number 16. Being scolded without understanding why. Your dog may have done something that has upset or angered you, but the dog doesn't understand what they have done wrong or what is happening. So by scolding your pet, you are expressing your anger and negativity without dealing with the real issue. This can make your dog stressed and confused. Instead, Use positive reinforcement to reward the behavior you like and ignore the ones you don't. Number 15. Forced socialization. Even though they are group animals, dogs don't always desire to interact with people. You fall further behind the group the more you pander to the puppy. Just like humans, dogs don't naturally bond with all dogs. So if your furry companion is hostile towards some dogs, don't keep putting them together and hoping they'll become friendly. Number 14 over exercise fit people who go for daily runs or bike rides often take their dogs with them for company but extended runs can be hard or harmful for certain breeds or senior dogs for instance short-nosed breeds like pugs and bulldogs have respiratory issues that are not good for running long distances if your dog is older than eight always consult with your vet and get their advice for the exercise requirement number 13 summer heat while your dog does have some sweat glands in their pores, these do little to help control their body temperature instead of a dog's major cooling mechanism. Dogs do not sweat, so they do not withstand extreme temperatures as well as humans do. Number 12. Rough housing. Children are unpredictable and impulsive. They can sometimes irritate or annoy a dog, especially one who is unused to their unpredictable and energetic nature. Kids may pull on a dog's ears or tail poke its eyes, or try to ride a big dog before you have kids over ask their parents to explain the protocol to their children. If the kids want to play hard and your dog seems concerned, put them in a room that is off limits to the children. Number 11. Teasing them with treats. Even while it may seem like fun and games to you and your dog, that isn't the reality. Treats should always be given as a reward, never as a means of teasing or tricking your pet. Number 10. Not feeding them on time. Dogs are like little kids, they get hungry at all different times of day and night. If you don't feed them at a set time, then they might not be able to sleep and will wake up growling. This can be a problem if you're trying to sleep too. So if you want your dog to be happy, feed them on time. Number 9. Loud music. Loud noises are stressful for your dog. Because dogs have much more sensitive hearing than humans canines can hear sounds four times as far as humans. Dogs can be very agitated by noises that don't bother us at all. Thunder, fireworks, 
police sirens, and loud vehicles are probably the most common noise phobia triggers. People who listen to loud music in their cars with their dogs in the car are probably harming their dogs. Number 8. Pulling on their ears or tail. Dogs do not like it when humans pull on their ears or tail. This is because these appendages are sensitive to touch and can even be painful for dogs if pulled. If a dog's ears are being pulled, he may shake his head or try to escape from your grip. If a dog's tail is being pulled, he will most likely cower away from you and possibly snap at you with his teeth. Number 7. Arguing in front of them. Perhaps you and your spouse are having a heated dispute when someone starts to cry or the conversation becomes loud. It's simple to forget that someone is watching the altercation take place and your dog will become stressed. Dogs may bark at you or approach you carrying a toy in an effort to break up a fight. Some dogs will also take your prized possessions if they know you'll lead the argument to go after them. Regardless of what they do, your dog can tell when anything is off. You shouldn't be in a hostile setting, and neither should your dog. Number 6. Too much alone time. Dogs are pack animals, meaning they thrive on companionship and don't like to be alone for long periods of time. In fact, dogs who spend too much time alone can become anxious, depressed, and stressed. If you're going to be gone for more than a few hours, make sure to leave your dog with an interactive toy or some food puzzles to keep them occupied while you're away. Number 5. Hitting. Hitting a dog is never appropriate, and it's also one of the behaviors that dogs find most offensive. If you feel as though your pet has done something wrong or is acting up, you should first try to calmly speak with them in a firm voice to let them know that they need to stop or correct their behavior. If this doesn't work, you can always give them a quick timeout by removing them from whatever situation they're in. Number 4. Being the potty police. Be kind with your dog when it comes to potty training. Dogs love to sniff and explore their surroundings, so forcing them to go potty while you're out for a walk is cruel. Number 3. A tight leash. A loose leash means you are communicating to your dog that everything is good and at ease because dogs are able to perceive human tension levels through their leash. On the other side, a tight leash denotes tension or anxiety. If their leash is constantly being pulled, dogs become agitated. It hurts them, has the potential to hurt them, and can frustrate them. Number 2. Being upset. According to recent studies, when people weep, their pets also become upset. You cannot expect to be happy all the time because life has its ups and downs. However, if you are experiencing despair or stress, it will inevitably have an impact on your friends. Some dogs will mimic your feelings by becoming depressed, agitated, or even unwell. Try your best to maintain a schedule and spend time with your dog. Dogs are a terrific source of emotional support. Dogs are particularly adept at animal-assisted therapy for a reason. Number 1. Ignoring them. Don't neglect your canine companion when the baby is present. Studies have proven that dogs make for happier newborns. When you introduce a baby into your home, disregard the dogs, which can be challenging for a dog because they are no longer the focus of attention. Having a pet raises serotonin levels, which boosts happiness and overall well-being. So that's all for it for today's video. I hope you all like this video. Please let us know in the comment box about your opinion, and do recommend some topics you want to see in the video in the future.